Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I am doing a review on these Real Technique brushes that I just discovered at Ulta. I got the foundation brush. This one is a little brown because I did use it already to test it out. Um, and then I got the contour brush, which looks like this. And then I have the... This one is the shadow brush, which is obviously for your eyes, for your eyeshadow. That looks like this. Um, I actually loved the brush. My main excitement and um, was this foundation brush because I am so used to using the Real Techniques uh, blender, uh, the beauty sponge, and. It tends to like tear and stuff so I really don't like that so when I saw the brush I was really excited to try it out so I'm gonna show you guys how it applies I'm gonna apply the foundation with it to show you guys um, now the foundation one is $19.99 but I did get these on sale so it came out to $14.80 because they took out 519 because it was buy two get one free and then the contour one is $16.99 which is this bad boy right here and then the crease brush is $12.99 so in total well I'm not gonna say I did because my hubby bought these uh, but they were $36.98 so if you purchase two you get one free I don't think the sale is going on anymore uh, but when I did purchase them a couple of days ago well when my husband purchased them a couple of days ago um, when I got them they were on sale so um, like I said this is the foundation brush right here I love I actually love this brush and this is the contour one and I believe they have other ones um, they just had them repeatedly so I don't remember exactly what the other ones were called um, but I know they did have other ones there and this is the eye one it is very 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 soft on the bristles they are like tight bristles so your application is gonna be pretty smooth. It does glide on. I think the application is very, very, it applies really nicely. Um, I like how tight the bristles are. They're very, very soft. Um, they're not like other brushes where the bristles are like really like pokey and harsh when you apply it. Um, these are really, really soft. You see the bristles like that they're really really nice so I am gonna show you in the next clip how it applies so just keep on watching we are about to get like close and personal um, if you guys see that I am wearing my glasses because I'm trying to make sure that I am in focus <laughs> and I am like super super blind so I'm trying to make sure I'm in focus because if not like I can't see I'm like super blind but anyways um, I did prime my face and I am using the new Dewy Wet n Wild face primer. Guys, this primer is really, really nice. Look at that. I'm going to show you guys real quick. It doesn't have, it doesn't have a scent, but let me see if I can show you guys. It's, it has like a, like a shimmer type of finish and it's like really sticky when it dries on your face, which I, in my opinion, I think it's a good thing. Um, see how it's, it's like really, it's all in my nails, <laughs> but it's like really shimmery and I actually, I really, really like this, um, wet and wild, um, face primer. Bixby is like so weird. I'm talking and she just like lights up my phone. 
she just lights up because I guess I don't know what I said that she thought I was calling her but anyways um, yeah it's it's really nice and once you apply it it's like really sticky on your face so I honestly in my opinion think that when the primers are sticky it helps your foundation stick and makes it last longer so I did prime my face already so let's go ahead and add this foundation I'm using the um, wet and wild um, photo focus foundation so let's just apply this one I love this foundation guys especially the spatula that it has it makes it easier to to apply it you guys are probably like, why the hell does she still have her glasses on? I'm telling you guys, I'm so blind. And the way that I have my um, camera set up right now, I have to have my glasses on because if not, I'm not going to see because I don't have it set up the other way where I can take them off. And plus, I'm just applying foundation, so it's not really a big deal. At least not to me, but okay. should like put my glasses up guys my eyebrows my eyebrows are like looking so crappy because when I was putting on the primer it kind of like took them off oh my gosh wow I'm trying to do it in like circular motions and then I'm trying to do it in like just kind of swiping motion because I know the actual correct way would be like circular motions but uh, I'm trying to get feel for the brush let's see what the foundation um, box says densely packed oval head for cream or liquid foundation application use circular motions to evenly apply all over your face which is what I am doing my little hairs are getting all over they're going all over the face I'm trying to blend in with my foundation but guys this foundation I mean the uh, foundation brush is really really good I'm actually really loving this so you know what let me apply some powder and see if I know it does claim that it is just for cream or liquid foundation but let's just try with powder and see what it does. I'm gonna use the airspun powder. Oh my god, this stuff is like so loose and fine that it's all over the place. I just want to see if I just want to see what it does and if it you can use it for powder I know that if it was meant for powder it would say for powder but I'm just curious so I think you can apply this powder but you have to go like really light-handed to stuff is like all over my pants and I'm wearing like black pants okay so there you have it guys um, I just wanted to get this video out there because I think that these brushes are pretty awesome and you guys should give it a try um, 
So if you guys have not picked these up, and this video is not sponsored by Real Techniques, I wish it was. This bad boy just replaced that blender, that beauty sponge. So if you guys have not tried these, um, pick them up and give them a shot. And um, I still have to play with these two. I'm not gonna do it now um, on this video, but I do want to play with these and kind of get the feel for these. But this foundation one was like the one that I really wanted to try, and I am really loving it. So if you guys have tried it, put it down in the, the comments below and let me know how you liked it. Um, but yeah, guys, that is all for today. If you have not. Um, already hit that subscribe button. Make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye guys.